आज म तपाईहरुलाई बीएड सेकेन्ड इयर को यो मेजर इंग्लिश सब्जेक्ट रिडिङ्स फर द न्यू होराइजन्स भन्ने मेजर इंग्लिश सब्जेक्ट को आज म तपाईहरुलाई चाहिँ यो युनिट 6 राइटर्स एट वर्क भन्ने युनिट 6 को चाहिँ आज म तपाईलाई चाहिँ के सोल्भ गरेका क्वेशनहरु म तपाईलाई चाहिँ शेयर गर्ने छु यो युनिट मा पनि तपाईहरुलाई तपाईले चाहिँ तीनवटा चाहिँ लेसनहरु चाहिँ तपाईले चाहिँ पढ्नु पर्ने हुन्छ यो युनिट 6 मा राइटर्स एट वर्क भन्ने युनिट मा चाहिँ तपाईले तीनवटा लेसनहरु चाहिँ पढ्नु पर्ने हुन्छ तिनै लेसनहरु को चाहिँ म तपाईलाई चाहिँ यो सोल्भ गरेका क्वेशनहरु केही इम्पोर्टेन्ट क्वेशनहरु म तपाईलाई चाहिँ शेयर गर्ने छु अ यहाँ तपाईहरु हेर्न सक्नुहुन्छ लेसन 1 मा चाहिँ इन्टरभ्यू विथ रोबर्ट प्रस्ट यो चाहिँ रहेको छ इन्टरभ्यू विथ रोबर्ट प्रस्ट क्वेशन नम्बर ए मा रहेको छ डिस्कस द मेजर कन्ट्रिब्युसन्स मेड बाइ रोबर्ट प्रस्ट इन द फिल्ड अफ पोएट्री Robert Lee Frost, March 26, 1874, January 29, 1963, was an American poet. His work was initially published in England before it was published in America. Known for this realistic depictions of rural life of his command of American colon colloquial speech Frost frequently wrote about setting settings from rural uh, life in New e England in the early 20th century, using them to examine complex social and philosophical themes. Frost was honored frequently during his lifetime, receiving four Pulitzer Beauty, uh, Beauty prize prizes for poetry or become he became one of america's rare public rare public li literary uh, figures almost an art artistic institution he was awarded the congressional gold medal in 1960 for his poetic works on july 22 uh, 1961 frost was named poet Lurit of Vermont Poet Laureate of Vermont I have a question number echo echo This is a question number we may have summarize the text interview with Robert Frost Robert Frost 1874 born 1963 died is one of the most well-known american poets of the 20th century he has written most of the poems about the country's life with the rural settings when he first lived in england from 1912 to 1915 he achieved his first literary success the boys will 1913 and north of Boston 1914 are his major literary works. Most of his poems are concerned with people interact with environment and reflect the life in rural New England America where the way of choosing language is based on the regional speech. He declares that poetry makes us remember what we did not know. He further claims that poetry begins in delight and ends in wisdom. Frost is proud of saying that he is a democrat because he was born in democracy. This is question number C. Write a biography biographical essay on Robert Frost Robert Frost was born in San Francisco, California to journalist William Prescott Frost J.R. and Isabel uh, Moody 
His mother was a Scottish immigrant and his father descendant descended from Nicholas Frost of Tiburton, Devon, England, who had uh, sailed to New Hampshire in 1634 on the Wolfrena. Wolf, Wolfrena. In, 19, in 1894, he sold his first poem, My Butterfly, an elegy published in the November 8, 1894 edition of the New York Independent for $15. Frost attended Harvard, Uni Harvard University from 1897 to 1899 but he left voluntarily due to illness in 1915 during World War First. Frost returned to America where he holds where holds American edition of A Boy's Will had recently been published uh, and bought a farm in Franconia, New Hampshire. where he launched a career of writing, teaching and lecturing. In 1934, Frost began to spend winter months of Florida. In March 1935, he gave a talk at the University of Miami. In 1940, he bought a 5-acre 2.0 HA a plot in South Miami Florida naming in Pencil Pines. He spent his w winters there for the first for the rest of his life. Robert Frost's pers uh, personal life was plagued by grief and loss. In 1885, when he was 11, his father died to tuberculosis, leaving the family with just eight dollars. Frost mother died of cancer in 19, 1900. In 1920, he had to commit his younger sister Jenny to a mental hospital where she died nine years later. Mental illness apparently ran, an I ran in Frost Frost's family, as both he had, he and his mother suffered from depression, and his daughter Irma was committed to a mental hospital in 1947. Frost's wife Eleanor also experienced a bout of depression. Uh, you say, I got you, you summary uh, biography. Your Robert Frost was a uh, biography. Uh, your main data list of LT, Alka Yad Gonola. Your underlying correct for a lament of LT, Yad Gonola. This is a good time. My work was listen, ma. Then it's a listen to ma. Interview with Moyan. Question number MRX. Uh, write a biographical essay on Moyan. Moyan, a Nobel Prize winner in literature in 2012, was born in 1955 in Shandong village, China. He was born into a poor farming family. When he was a child, it was the most difficult time in the history of China because most people were starving at the time. At that time. He was expelled in fifth grade for uh, several reasons like cultural revolution, class struggle, insecurity, poverty, and no favorable environment in school for learning. Then he started herding cattle and sheep and often felt lonely because he saw all of the, his friends going to school. His motivation for writing was influenced 
through his family, village and school. When Moyan later started writing, everything in his childhood memories came back in came back to him. Thus, he used this mem these memories mixed with ideas and events from real life when he started writing novels at the very beginning. He informs us that there are mainly two recurring themes on his work, hunger and loneliness. When Moyan, Moyan left school in his earlier age and started herding cattle and sheep, then he became successful to establish an imitate, intimate relationship with nature. He was surrounded by sheep, cattle, plants, grass, and trees every day. He makes a satire to China that thought that though China is progressing in economic condition in the world, it has created pollution. He defines literature as a form of art. Literature is not just for fun because its precious quality is based on its story of the human soul. He believes that the relationship of literature and society is more more similar like the relationship of people with their hair. Moyan says that he is a polytheist. He also opens his sacred by saying, I am not a follower of any one religion. religion. Uh, you say Moyan ko biography Ragosa biographical essay biography ragosa a number co answer this is a number so you have to tell it is c number so it's a b number and it a b number so discuss the view of moyan about religion he defines literature as a form of art literature is not just for fun because its precious quality is based on its story of the human soul. He believes that the relationship of literature and society is more similar like the relationship of people with their hair. Moyan says that he is a polytheist. He also opens his sacred by saying, I am not a follower by any one religion. This is the lesson on the lesson. Interview with Orphan Pamuk. Write a biographical essay on Orphan, Orphan Pamuk. Orphan Pamuk was born in 1952 in Istanbul, Turkey. He is one of the tur Turkey's most prominent novelists. He was awarded Nobel Prize in Literature in 2006. Pamuk wanted to be a painter. He left the architecture school after three years to become a full-time writer. He decided to quit being painter after he wrote his personal memory na named Istanbul Memories of a City. Kevdet by Kevdet Bey and his sons was a first novel of Pamuk. This novel is typical based on 19th century realism. However, Pamuk faced a number of challenges during writing this novel. For instance, it took four years to complete and another four years to publish because getting publication was hard, hard at, ti at time. Snow was his second novel. It is a political novel. During writing this novel there was the military revolution so that Pamuk thought and realized that he could not publish this novel and then decided to write third novel. Other popular novels 
written by Pamuk are the silent house my name is red the white castle and the black book according to Pamuk Montaigne Montaigne was the first creator for the French and Western civilization Montaigne contributed not only for developing the enlightenment and glorification of Western thoughts but also about the solitary person Pamuk is influenced by the idea of Montaigne about solitary person similarly influenced by the view of Montaigne England, uh, Engdahl uh, also s I states that when the friend dies he had to find someone else and that that is eventually the reader uh, you say a number ko, uh, question answer rakha cha yo biographical biography bhanam yo orphan orphan pamu ko cha biography ye lai cha pala chai yaad garnu hola tesi kari arko yo number ya <coughs> bima rakha cha discuss view of pamu about mountain According to Pamuk, Montaigne was the first creator for the French and Western civilization. Montaigne contributed not only for developing the enlightenment and glorification of Western thoughts, but also about the solitary person. Pamuk is influenced by the idea of Montaigne about solitary person, similarly influenced by the view of Montaigne. Engdahl also states that when the friend dies, he also has he has to find someone else and that is eventually the reader you say you might think I saw you grab this way son your question me they were you might you say the village at granola you take part in the valley question to yad granola this is a very hard question right so write a review of a book that you have read muna madan and epic other words are going to book money about this could it will be in a second answer that's a Muna Madan got the exit Muna Madan and epic it is a darkly passionate tale of poor miserable condition or should we call it a highly original original contemporary story the book was written by Lakshmi Prasad Devkota Muna Madan is in my opinion a unique story of poor people written in 1990 19, uh, 1996 bs in it is an epic full of desire hate and lamentation the story is set in rural area of nepal when modern goes to lhasa to earn money his wife muna, muna laments for separation Modern insists on going there and finally he goes there with his friends. He leaves Muna at home to take care of his widow mother. He earns some money and returns home with his friends. On the way to his home, he becomes sick and is left by his friend friends on the way. One of the both, one of the Bhote helps him uh, and cures him. Later on, Madan returns home, but when he arrives, he hears his wife as as well his mother's death. Death of his family members to lead leads the story heart break and tragedy. The main characters are Muna and Modern. Modern could be described uh, as hero with his behavior. He struggles for survival. He represents many uh, mainly achievement. Muna, his wife, repre represents ideal woman who shows loyalty or, or fidelity to her husband. 
Mother's mother represents the old age people who depend on their sons and daughters. Daughter in law lost in their old age. Mother's friends who lives who live his who leave him on the way to home seems to be selfish friends. The bote who helped him is kind hearted person. Although finally family members of Madan's family suffer from poverty. The readers empathize empathize with these uh, characters. In fact, this is the main reason why I believe this epic unique. It rings with truth. The readers may be horrified at the way that modern decides in the beginning of leaving home, but the writer ensures that, ensures that we never hate him because the reasons for leaving home are crystal clear. The main parts of the book re relies on a narrator modern who himself narrated the whole story the content of his book this book successfully represents the contemporary society and touches our heart by presenting heart rending story of a modern's family however muna modern is not what i would call an essay easy read there are some lines which are written in dialect which can be difficult to understand nevertheless i through truly enjoyed this book in fact i couldn't put it down i preserved an all in all i can highly recommend it muna modern i challenge you to remain unmoved after reading this exceptional book of nepali literature by the end of this book you will uh, really feel feel sad you uh, say right it's a muna modern book review this is a great about it's our book or to be part of a nepali english book or to be able to say uh review say to be able to say like now यो चाहिँ एउटा एक्जाम्पल राख छ मुनामदनको अ हुन्छ यो चाहिँ रहेको थियो युनिट 6 को चाहिँ राइटर्स एट वर्क भने यो युनिट 6 को चाहिँ लेसन अ तीन वटा यसमा रहेको छ त्यो तीनटा लेसन को चाहिँ मैले तपाईलाई चाहिँ केही इम्पोर्टेन्ट भनम अब अलिकति सोधिन हल्का यो टेक्स्ट बाट इम्पोर्टेन्ट जस्तो क्वेशनहरु चाहिँ यहाँ नेर चाहिँ रहेका थिए आ, यो क्वेश्चन अर्को सॉल्व करे क्वेश्चन अर्चे मल्ल तो पहला चाहे सीआर करे इसमें कती वे क्वेश्चन अरु चाहे अब नली नो चाहे नहीं पनी छन मतलब त्यो क्वेश्चन जी तो पहला चाहे क्वेश्चन से याद करनो ना तेरे को आंसर चाहे तो पहला चाहे था पाओ था उन्हु पाने सा रा कती चाहे नहीं चाहे जून जी तो पहला चाहे याद करनो पाने ने तो पहले चाहिए यो बायोग्राफी चाहिए याद करने पाने उनसा उनसा आज लाई ये तीने उन्हें समय में मो औरो यूनिट और कोनी मतलब पहले चाहिए सर ने सॉल्व करे क्वेश्चन और मतलब पहले शेयर करे ने शु तब सो मेरे पिटेल तब पहले लाइक कर दिनो ला और शेयर कर दिनो ला और आइल सो बने मेरे चैनल ला तब पहले सब्सक्राइब करनो बाय